What am I going to say? <laughs> We've been doing it for 60 weeks, so we do, we're a little on seasoned vet now. Am I allowed to sing on mine? Yes, definitely sing. What is your vision for the next five years? When Michael Brady on today's episode said he is putting this into his pitch for what loan officers should be asking IMBs, it really hit home. I've been doing this now for 70 straight weeks with Mike, and we've been challenging how lenders think of themselves moving forward. But the reality is most loan officers will still be in this business for the next five years. They can't help it. Even if they're close to retirement age, they are just wiser and have the ability to use their skills with technology in the future. But this industry is changing. And the loan officers that will be extinct are the ones that don't skill up. And the good news is you can either skill up through technology, learning items like AI and ChatGPT, not to transform how you are able to just automatically get loans. Like Michael said, that doesn't happen. But you can have the ability to aggregate and enrich data to personalize your outgoing messages and your outgoing outbound or what I like to call all bound marketing to give you more swings. But consumers are going to go through bots and this and that. But at the end, end of the day, they want to get on the line with somebody that within 30 seconds of talking to them, they know it's somebody that knows what they're talking about. And that's where you need to skill up. With all this said, I think we learned the mindset of what somebody running or steering the ship at an IMB thinks about when they implement technology. They can take all these world vision ideas that I have moving forward, but they do have to simplify it for their sales force. They do have to integrate it with legacy software, and they do have to help loan officers handle and their whole team handle change management. Hey now, you're an all-star. Get your game on. Go play. Hey now, you're an all-star. Get your show on. Get paid. This episode was so awesome because in the acronym of TEAM, together, everybody achieves more. We had an opportunity to talk to Mike Brady over at Leader One. And what an amazing accomplishment they've had. Not only are they able to stay in business for an extended period of time, their leadership with greater than 50 years of combined leadership experience. What that means is they stay in the company. They're able to open the Komodo and show you what it's all about when it comes to the ability to create and do more business. This is Michael Brady with Leader One Financial. Uh, thank you for allowing me to kind of show my core and my beliefs uh, and what we do as an organization here at Leader One Financial. Uh, we truly, truly believe that um, our partners are part of our organization. Uh, we don't look at everyone as an employee. Uh, they're actually family, you know, and trying to better their lives so that they can have a great home balance and work balance for the future and sharing their abilities to help them grow their business. Uh, sharing allows 10 multiple of the return back to your life, your livelihood, your, you know, your, your work, your family, all of that. We as an organization um, can always do better, but we are providing a future for our sales and operation teams uh, beyond originating. We give the ability to build your own business here at Leader One Financial. And it's truly a remarkable journey that we've done over the last 33 years. And again, I want to thank you. Thanks, Mike and Michael, uh, for the opportunity and um, look forward to future podcasts.